there's a bunch of news in the apex world and i'm going to be covering it for you guys let's get right into it before we do make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel now let's talk about newcastle so newcastle is going to be the next legend that's coming to apex legends we got our first leak as of yesterday he popped up on a billboard in olympus right in the middle of hammond and it said the wait is over he's here and it showed a silhouette of newcastle we know that's newcastle because we've seen him in the legend select a couple weeks back whenever all those leaks were coming out so newcastle is going to be the next legend let's talk about his abilities now okay so what i'm showing on screen right now is actually newcastle's abilities as of two weeks ago so these could change over time we'll have to wait and see but newcastle as of now as of what we know is going to have a shield just like lifeline and you're able to move it around in different directions and stuff like that it's super useful he's like a better version of gibby it seems like so that's his tactical right that's the shield that he gets now his ultimate he can fly up in the air slam down and create cover in front of him so yeah that's actually pretty insane i think that the cover needs to deploy a little bit faster for it to be like super useful but uh yeah he seems like a better version of gibby and he might be added into the competitive meta for sure whenever he comes out. So I am a, uh, pretty excited for Newcastle. I like support legends. I like defensive legends like this. Um, that's just who I personally like to play. I'm a, I'm a Gibby main and competitive. I'm a Gibby main and, main and ranked. And then when it comes to pubs, I just kind of play whatever just for fun. But Newcastle so far looks pretty sick. If you guys think that Newcastle looks sick or want him to be changed a little bit, let me know what should be changed about him down in the comments. I kind of want to hear your guys' opinions on this. Uh, so far, like I said, he looks pretty dope. Um, maybe his shield is going to be, maybe he can actually grab it and move it around to different locations. It looks like he can just pivot it pivot the shield as of now so we'll have to see if that changes over time now we did get a confirmed leak about four days ago showing that the small shield capacitor is going to be coming to the game you can see in this screenshot somebody's actually using it but yeah basically what the uh what that's going to do is it's going to heal a small amount of shield and it's going to be a 60 second cooldown now it looks like this person is popping it just like a regular shield cell but what i heard is it's supposed to uh it's supposed to heal shield over time and it's not supposed to just heal it instantly uh regardless it's going to be a new survival item we don't have a ton of details about it so again we'll just have to wait and see but i wanted to uh to bring this to your faces because this is worth noting now to end this video off i'm going to be showing you guys a clip of this spot that you can get in on storm point i'm going to roll that clip after this video is over but i wanted to let you guys know that uh that we're doing a discord event um we're going to be getting together and playing some games together and just hanging out and chilling and vibing with the community so if you want to get involved in that it's going to be scheduled on my discord link is down in the description also please like the video if you did like the video and uh, make sure to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and i will see you guys in the next video gotta hop up here turbocharger 